NASA Tech Center, the oldest and largest technology center in Oklahoma's career tech program, recently opened its new automotive training facility at its Broken Arrow campus. The automotive program has a special focus on natural gas vehicles, one of the first of its kind in the nation and the first in Oklahoma. The event was attended by such dignitaries as T. Boone Pickens, the famed oil man and natural gas supporter, and Congressman John Sullivan, who co-authored House Bill 1380, or the Nat Gas Act. Dignitaries rolled into the facility on board a large CNG-powered bus. Tulsa Tech Superintendent Dr. Kara Gay Neal said natural gas is increasingly important in the energy industry and gave credit to Pickens, who speaks often of America's need to get off OPEC oil dependency. We're just so glad that Boone Pickens came and made this day so special. He is the draw, but so is an energized business community about alternative fuels. And we think that has been a wonderful combination to inaugurate and dedicate this facility. Tulsa Tech is the state's leading technology center, graduating over 3,200 students a year. Phil Birkenbile, director of Career Tech, said that for Oklahoma to continue to lead the nation in low unemployment, Schools like Tulsa Tech need to continue to focus on putting students to work. Right now I can identify 5,000 jobs across the state of Oklahoma that need to be filled and they're not low wage jobs. They're $40,000 and up. And we've got to train our students and get them in those jobs. We're meeting with companies individually saying, what do we need to do to help you in the way of a product? And that product is a trained student to meet their needs. Congressman Sullivan added that as one of Congress's leading advocates for natural gas, he admires Tulsa Tech's focus on alternative fuels. They see what the promise is for natural gas in this country, and especially natural gas vehicles. They have a program here to, to help train students to do conversions on vehicles and get involved in this, this massive explosion that's going to happen in this country of natural gas vehicles. When that increase in natural gas vehicles does come, Tulsa Tech students will be the ones leading the way.